Hi Taurus, welcome to my channel. This is a weekly collective tarot reading session for you Taurus. I hope you are well. I hope you're fine and safe and doing good. This is a weekly reading for you. Let us see what is happening towards you Taurus. What is the message that is meant for you to know? And ready for you to know this is for the Taurus sign, okay? Oops. Before I start, I would like to thank you guys for coming back. Thank you so much for being here. Thank you so much for supporting the channel. Yes, viewers, if you haven't clicked the bell, click the bell now and click subscribe. This reading for today, this is for the Toru sign. Let's see what's coming towards you guys. What can I get for Toru space? Okay. If you would like to further connect with me, Taurus, I invite you to also be part of our mailing list. Um, to do that, the link is down in the description box below. Or head towards the website. You will see uh, the part where you can register and um, subscribe in our mailing list. We send out new moon, full moon, bonus reading. Okay, so if you want to receive that directly in your inbox, please do subscribe, okay? So let's get your overall energy. What can I get for Taurus? Overall energy. This is a weekly collective reading. You have the Queen of Pentacles. The Queen of Pentacles, this is um, this is a mother. You know, uh, Queen of Pentacles is unconditional. She gives unconditional time and support, possibly money. And um, she, take, she takes care of a lot of stuff. So I feel like Taurus, with you, you're looking into whether it's worth taking care of this people person or situation you're questioning someone let me just close something okay so i feel like for you taurus um your your overall energy comes toward come, come towards to me as a um you're questioning whether do they actually care about me because I care about them. So there is a question about support. There's a question of caring, maybe love. And um, you're being wise. You're actually being so wise on who you care and if they care about you. So there's a, there's a very strong emphasis and focus on the core people that you need to take care of. And you would only take care of them if they take care of you. So you're being, you're, you're going towards to that energy, being wise and practical about your money, about the time you allocate to people, person, situation, okay? Now let's pick up more intuitive message for you. You've got the Nine of Pentacles, the Queen of Swords, the Page of Cups. Um, I really feel like you're working towards your stability. You know, the Nine of Pentacles is a single lady and um, I really feel like your focus is about you, your stability, you're regaining your strength. You are really working towards having a peaceful, stable, and um, meaningful life. You know, um, you're, the center of your attention is the Nine of Pentacles, money and yourself and stability. Uh, nothing will come first. Um, you first, you know, in, in the Nine of Pentacles in here, okay? Yeah, five of wands. You will fight um, if someone it if someone tries to um, disturb or if some if a person if a situation or if an energy tries to get you out of the nine of pentacles, you will fight to get back on track. Okay, whether it's people, person, situation, or energy, whatever this is, you won't allow them to take. You won't allow a person or situation to take away your power. Nine of Pentacles, the Five of Wands in here. You have the Queen of Swords. Um, I feel like you're waiting for someone or you're open to talk. You're open to a negotiation. Yeah, you have the Chariot card. The, ne the negotiation is about moving, movement. Um, you're okay. Like with the Chariot card in here, you're okay to move. You're okay to transfer. You are okay to uh, transform something. But the way you transform movement, um, changes, and this is quick, you want it all sorted, okay? There's something in here that you're negotiating the movement, transformation, or point from point A to point B. You're open to that, you know? But it has to be fine print, or it has to be proper. 
with the Queen of Swords, the Chariot card. Yeah, Ace of Wands. Yeah, like, you know, you're really on to, yeah, movement. I'm really picking up. Yeah, come on. Yeah, sure. You want to move? You want me to move out? You want to move out? You want to go there? I want to go here. Yeah, let's separate or let's let's have a talk on how are we going to move, okay? Whether moving forward together or moving out, moving in. But yeah, let's put a structure on how we move, okay? Now you have a page of cups in here. Now, the page of cups, this is a message, okay? It's coming from a younger Cancer Scorpio Pisces energy. You have the Hierophant card. You have a commitment to someone. This is you. You're committed to this person. You are committed to someone. Apart from this, you know, and that, you you have you are you have committed somebody some to someone. A magician card. I feel like you're protecting. I feel like you're protecting someone, and you're committed to give your all to this page of cups. It could be, um. Like for some of you, I'm getting like, if they say sorry, I will give it all. I will forgive them. For some of you, you're committed to a younger, maybe a son, a daughter. But you're committed to give everything to the Page of Cups. Yeah, Magician card. And the Justice card. So, you are going to give it all when it comes to something, someone. Okay? The, nothing can stop you to give the happiness of a person or a situation in here. Yeah, two of cups. You will do everything for this person or this situation, okay? You are, you are, you are progressive, but you're not stupid. There's something in here that you will fight if it's worth it. And if it's not worth it, you will be open to compromise. But it should be, um, the compromise should be for the benefit of this person. It's more of like, you know, it's a feeling where, Maybe you're negotiating a divorce, a separation in here, or a goodbye, and your main focus is the kids, okay? So that's your main focus is, you know, for some of you're protective of someone or somebody. It could be a relationship, it could be someone, but you're okay to lose everything, but not this, you know, maybe your kid, your, your daughter, or someone that you're protecting with, okay? Someone you pledge to be, um, to be together. Let's see if this is love. Yeah, three of pentacles. Page of pentacles. And the king of cups. Yeah, there's a king of cups in here. The page of the... Where's the queen of cups? Yeah, there's no queen of cups. There's a queen of pentacles, but there's no... Yeah. So I feel like um, if this is love... I really feel like there's a king of cups. There's love in here. But the king of cups is facing this way. Not, the, not facing this way. I feel like it's more of if this is romantic if you're protecting your relation if you are protecting your relationship if you're protecting if you're gonna do everything for a romantic relationship in here Taurus I feel like you have to make sure that you're that they are at the same page because you're making an effort you're giving a page of pentacles but they're looking on the other side let's see what this person is looking at in the king of cups yeah six of pentacles you know let's see do they love you yeah page of swords they give you a page of swords. Like, this is not so much to work on. I feel like, Taurus, if you're going to give it all to a person, to a situation, you have to make sure that you're at the same page. Because it's very platonic. You know, I'm really picking up platonic. I'm very, I'm, I'm picking up a platonic energy. What is the page of swords coming from a romantic situation? Yeah. Because you might want to save it. This person would like to break up. You know, so, yeah, so, sorry, there was a message. So, yeah, you're giving it all, and this person is wanting to break up. So, make sure that you are at the same page when it comes to this person's situation. Because I'm picking up, you want to fix it, you want to give it all. This person, like, would like to break up. So, what's the point? You have to make sure, okay, before you go full time, okay? Now, what else is coming towards you is you got the page, five of swords, yeah. The page of swords, five of swords. Make sure that you are in alignment. I mean, martyrdom. You know, I'm really picking up. Don't be a martyr. Don't be blindsided by love. You need to also be practical. Um, you've got the moon card. Confusion. Yeah, death card. There's a part of you that would like to let go. But there's a part of you that would like to stay. And so it gives you seven of swords. Confuse. 
to stay or to go. Yeah, eight of pentacles. This person that you want to stay or you want to go, they're so focused. You're waiting for this person to offer you the Knight of Cups. This person is busy and you want them to offer you the Knight of Cups. Let's see if they're going to offer it to you. Queen of Wands. I don't feel like this is you. I feel like this person is so overworked. This person, th their priority is ambition. I don't think this is you, Queen of Wands. This is a competition. This is a competition. Yeah, Four of Wands. Be careful who you trust, who you love, because you guys are not the same page. You know, your expectation is different from this person. Let's see. Yeah, Two of Swords. I would suggest, Taurus, to check it out. If there is something that you're planning big in the next two weeks and you're dealing with someone who's quiet, I don't think you're at the same page. So be careful in who you pledge your loyalty, your love, your trust, your support. Because they're not seems they're they're not they're not seems to be the person that you expect. Okay? You have a ten of cups in here. Let's look at the ten of cups. Nine of wands, yeah. You're very tired, you know. I really feel like Taurus, you're tired chasing happiness you know yeah eight of cups i feel like taurus you really want happiness but it's so difficult to get with this person and i feel like you're coming to a point where if i'm not gonna give it to you if i'm not gonna get to you i better just walk away because i'm so tired there's nothing left with me you're losing your kind of respect or confidence or self-esteem you know yeah you're very confused there's a part of you that really wanting to let go and tired. Maybe you need to take a break. Because the happiness that you want, it's so hard to reach. There's something in here that it's so difficult to reach. It's so hard to gain. It's why it's so difficult to love. And I feel like when you feel this way, you have to step back and re regenerate, recuperate, and think it through. Is this really the happiness that you want? Because you have the devil, you have the devil card and the you know in the future you got the devil card and the world card. So there's a part, there's a, in the immediate future, I see you completing a cycle. And I feel you getting ready or getting stronger on, you know, like fighting the dark side or the, the, the devil in here. Your king of pentacles. Now this is your king of pentacles. Sun card. And the knight of swords. It's so difficult to get a commitment. You know, there's a person in here who is so difficult to get the sun card you have to chase the person to get what you want something tells me why do you have to fight to get what you want yeah you know you're kind of wondering what is the big secret you're wondering why is this person or situation so hard to get why it's so complicated and difficult why is that when it comes to you it's so easy to give this person is so stingy when it comes to giving yeah and so sad you want to you want to know the top secret on why this person is like this yeah they're holding back i feel like taurus your reading is about getting validation you know let me remind you that you're complete and you're perfect in your own skin or something in here really feels like you need to be validated or you need to get the approval or, or order for you to get happiness you need this person or situation you don't need that by default you are happy within you is a taurus that is resilient that is perfect enough with or without them yeah this is a very strong reading so if in doubt if in fear if you are confused step back and you know pull yourself together to get into a decision so this is what i have for you thank you taurus i'll see you soon i'll see you soon again guys you have a great day